Welcome to Audio Games Tutorial, a place where you can find walkthroughs and tutorials for accessible games for the blind and visually impaired. Option. Oh, let's play. Level 1. Level 8. Hall of Mirrors. I'm simply ecstatic that my cloaking device has proven helpful, Detective. And you were able to save my song, Lodadisk Blonde. Indeed, I wonder why she seems so intent on protecting the songs. She's always constructing little puzzles and games for me and the other robots to stumble through. But I feel this is different somehow. She seems more serious about the songs, as if they are more than simply a way to entertain herself. Certainly, I... Without the songs... Please, you... You don't know what you're doing. Right. Destroy your mind. No, I'm human. Pardon me, but I believe I just spoke the words. I am human. Was this perhaps a glitch on my part? No, I did actually say that. Oh dear. Detective, I... No, certainly not. I could not possibly be a human. How could you suggest such a thing? I told you, my memories of the past are quite erratic, due to how frequently Her Majesty reboots me. You really think I could be human? Perhaps that is why I have made it my purpose to find the songs. Because they are part of my mm, human nature. But it simply makes no sense. Even if I had been human, there's no reason why someone should make me transform. And Her Majesty. Her Majesty must know, of course. But why would she do nothing about it? Perhaps I was someone important. Or dangerous. Oh dear. We have been here far too long. We're not safe anywhere. With haste, Detective. With haste. We are just outside the Hall of Mirrors to assemble my song, Mirror, Mirror. This level is quite similar to the earlier hallway level, as the ladies and waiting bots are moving down the hallway towards us. I've disabled looking around, so merely use the WASD keys to navigate around them and locate the 16 audio zones. With no queen around, you can move swiftly to be able to complete the level before time runs out. With haste! You've run into the wall, Detective. zone is left. <laughs> Splendid! You've earned four pieces of cake. Continue to the next level. Marvelous, Detective. I do despise the Hall of Mirrors. You're lucky you have not the sight tonight. One is always looking after oneself in those mirrored walls. Detective, are you confident in your theory that I was once human? It does explain why I've been glitching ever since you arrived. I imagine that I regain more fragments of my human memory with each song you upload into my interface. 
But who do you think made me a robot in the first place? Oh dear, she is growing quickly nearer, detective. Conceal yourself behind this curtain. Ah, you have an inspired idea. I shall attempt to do some sleuthing in conversation with the Queen. Perhaps I shall prove to be as skilled a detective as you. Butler. Ah, your majesty, how lovely to see you. How may I be of assistance? No more games, garçon. I know you were talking to someone, and I want you to tell me who. I wouldn't. And if you lie to me this time, I know I've been chasing the thief, and I know they are stealing all my songs from me. My lady. Did you think I wouldn't notice? These precious songs are everything to me. They are more than you will ever know. I know you've been helping the wicked thief to get my songs. In fact, it could even be you who brought them here in the first place. And when I catch them, I will dispose of them in a... <laughs> suitable manner. And you, garçon, you think I'll just reboot you? <laughs> I'll do more than reboot you. I'll take you apart entirely, piece by piece, wire by wire, gear by gear, pièce par pièce, fil par fil, engrenage par engrenage, ne serait-ce pas amusant? And when you are nothing but broken parts, I'll display them somewhere where you will set an example. How does that sound? Befitting, Your Majesty. <coughs> Allow me to remedy my transgression. How may I be of assistance? Simply deliver your request, and I will do my utmost to please you. Why? Don't think you can distract me, garçon. I have no need of you just now. But I will be watching you, you and your little thief. Les carottes sont cuites. Les carottes sont cuites. Il ne faut pas vendre la peau de l'ours qui a si roulé la main à It is safe to emerge, detective. Oh dear, Her Majesty has never threatened me in such a way before. It seems our efforts were not as secretive as I had hoped. And this is indeed more critical than Her Majesty's other games. I believe we must not attempt to question the Queen at all, lest she become even more suspicious of me. We must venture on as we are. I've brought you to the chapel to locate my song, Marquis de Maud. And things are a bit different in this level. First, you need to locate and capture only the music zones. And then I'll place a beacon for you to find to lock them in. Once you capture the music zones and beacon, you move on to find all the drum zones. And then finally, capture the drum beacon to win the level. As usual, there are harm bots to avoid. And it's likely the Queen will make an appearance. She's been eating many macarons and petit four, so she may give chase with vigor, so be sure to cloak if she gets too close for comfort. Onward and good luck. Your task is to find all the music zones. Please make haste. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Nice work. I've dropped a beacon. Locate and capture it quickly to lock in the music tracks. Now your task is to find all the drum zones. Beware, detective. The queen has been alerted. of cake. Continue to the next level. Great job. Here we are, about to enter the servants' quarters to assemble my song, Let Them Eat Synth. And I fear the Queen has created a unique challenge for you to overcome. As usual, there are harm bots to avoid, and some audio zones are cloaked. But the Queen has figured out how to hide in cloaked mode with that audio and can move you in and out of cloak mode at will. If you end up cloaked, you'll have to find one to four audio zones before the queen finds your position, so act quickly. If you find them in time, you'll be returned to normal and can find audio zones amongst the harm bots. The queen only is a threat while cloaked, so act swiftly, shall we? Oh, <laughs> 
more zone is left. First rate job. You've earned three pieces of cake. Continue to the next level. Excellent job, detective. Procuring my song from the servants' quarters. The Queen is most definitely going to great lengths now to make things as difficult as possible. And the next level is no exception. As you can hear, we've moved outdoors into the night. Where the Queen has strewn my song, you bore me, bourgeoisie, throughout a complex garden maze. Once again, looking around is disabled. And you solely need WASD to navigate to locate the 20 audio zones. It's okay if you run into hedgerow walls, but do be on the alert for the many harm-barred guards. The real challenge is that if you miss a single zone, you'll have to restart the level. But don't tread too slowly, as you need to complete the level before the song ends. Off you go! Oh dear, the harm bot got you. Replay. Oh, Drat, you lost by missing the zone. Main mud. Oh, trash! You lost by missing the zone! Replay! Oh, 
of cake continue to the next level now that we've made it through that maddening maze i believe we are safe here for the time being detective i well it occurs to me that it may have been the queen herself that incited my robotic transformation although i fail to see how the songs could I will find them eventually. You can't keep up this charade forever. We'll take back the throne. Can't be stopped. A robot. Inside my mind. Not again. I can't tell you the agony this whole endeavor is doing to me. Oh dear. Do my ears deceive me, or are my words still a bit zwadded? Yes. What's that? Of course, you are most correct. If I go to the Queen now, she will undoubtedly trace my activity back to you. And then, there will be no hope. Detective, perhaps you could take a gander at the inside of my brain and identify the problem. Nothing too extensive. My programming is hmm, far too advanced for you to give me a thorough examination with no prior experience. But I'm certain you will notice if anything is glaringly wrong. Do attempt not to break anything. Oh, what a peculiar sensation. Did you find anything? I beg your pardon? You what? Oh dear, you really discovered a secret song hidden inside my brain? I suppose this is Her Majesty's last attempt to thwart us in our quest. I admit, I have no conception of how she was able to carry out such a task. Genius! Although it was hidden in my brain, it was not uploaded into my programming. Hence my inability to utilize it in restoring my memory. And of course the idea of looking never occurred to me at all. Regardless, Detective? Of course, you must now enter my brain and collect the parts of the song as usual. I've certainly no notion of what it may do to me, but I believe it is the only way forward. Prepare yourself, detective. I am transporting you now. Well, this is a novel situation. Hmm. Welcome to my brain. Now that you've uncovered my secret song, reject the data. You can hopefully find all the audio zones and return to the real world. The Queen has endeavoured to make this level as hard as possible. There are many stages to this level. So rather than explain it all now, I'll update you as things progress. Be careful, detective, and try not to damage my brain. Here we go. All you need to do is capture the drum zones first, and then the beacon. Finish those, and I'll give you the next instructions. Oh dear, the harm bot got you. Replay. All you need to do is capture the drum zones first, and then the beacon. Finish those, and I'll give you the next instructions. Oh 
dear, the harm bot got you. Replay! All you need to do is capture the drum zones first, and then the beacon. Finish those, and I'll give you the next instructions. Now find the beacon! Now your task is to find all the music zones. Now find the beacon! Find the two cloaked tracks quickly! Three pieces of cake. Continue to the next level. I must say, Detective, I can't tell you how relieved I am that you have exited my consciousness. It felt rather like having my brain tickled from the inside. I do say, my brain, as I have no doubt that I am human, and that Her Majesty the Queen was the one who devilishly transformed me, and to think I trusted her. I believe there is something we're missing, only I have no notion what it could be. Never mind. Onward, to the final song. It is here in the dungeons. I imagine it's the last place she thinks we'll look, but we can only hope that she doesn't make an appearance. Thought I wouldn't see through you, did you? Oh dear, your majesty! So, you uncovered my hidden song. I thought it was rather clever, but I suppose your little detective friend found it simple, huh? My lady. Quiet! You feel so proud of yourself, don't you? 
uncovering all my schemes. But I told you what would happen if you kept meddling in things you shouldn't. <laughs> and now I found the both of you together. Won't this be fun? C'est marrant, no? How convenient that we are already in the dungeon, detective. I'll keep you locked up in here until I find the perfect fate for you. And don't even think about trying to escape. That will only make me more... fâché. And you do not want to see what I am like, then? And you, my loyal butler. Poor little robot. I've kept you around too long. I was rather fond of you in the beginning, after all. But I'm out of patience. Oh, perhaps I should turn you human again, just to see your head cut off. Ooh. There are so many options. You had me fooled in the beginning. I will admit that. But it was foolish to think you could trick me for so long. After all, I am the ruler of this kingdom. Oh, a powerful, terrible ruler. No, nothing can stop me now. Not you, not your little friend. And once I've dealt with the boss of you, no one will know that you are the true king. <gasps> I'm what? What? No, the thing. I shouldn't have said that. Et voilà, je l'ai dit. Upon my word, for years I've been waiting on you, seeing to your every need, playing your silly games, tolerating your outbursts of wrath. And all this time, I've been the rightful ruler of the kingdom. You imprisoned me. You stole my throne. And who are you? A peasant? Some malicious traveler who thought you'd try your hand at ruling? Thought it might be fun? Well, no need to insult me. I'm your wife. Oopsie. Zut alors. Zut alors indeed. This is quite the turn of events. First, I am human, then I'm the king, and now you are my wife. Betrayed by my own wife? I can hardly believe it. Was this your design all along? Did you marry me just to usurp the throne? I suppose I loved you once. Mais maintenant, vous n'êtes plus qu'un insecte écrabouillé. I must say, I'm disappointed in you. Don't say that. I don't think it would be wise. After all, you are still powerless. Without the last song, you can't become fully human and retake your throne. And you are already in the dungeon. All I need to do is lock you in here until I decide on your final fate. Do not move. Don't move or I will cut off your head this minute. I must have the keys here, somewhere. Where are the keys to my dungeon? Detective, this is our final chance. You must retrieve the final song, Antiphon, before Her Majesty imprisons us here forever. We must act with haste, or there will be no hope of escape for either of us. Follow me, quickly. Oh, ils ont couru, you fools! You'll never get the last song before I capture you! Hurry, detective. Head down this dungeon corridor and capture all the zones before the song runs out. Looking around has been disabled. Good luck capturing the final song. You lost by missing the zone. Replay.
Missing the zone. Run this hellish dungeon. stolen my songs and my throne, erased my memory, and turned me into a robot. How can you expect my mercy now? Well, I will not be cruel, so consider yourself lucky. Now that you are imprisoned in the dungeon, you shall remain here for the rest of your life. Come, detective, let us depart these depressing dungeons, and maybe, if we're feeling generous later on, we'll bring the queen... Uh, um, my beloved wife, some of this delicious cake that you've been collecting. You cannot imprison your own wife, can you? No? Hey! Of course, Detective. I must upload the final song now and regain my throne before the Queen can try any more games. Uploading. Transferring. Downloading. Transforming. Ah, oh, at last. It feels so good to take a human breath again. Marvellous, Detective. I do believe we've done it. Uh, yes. I suppose you did do most of the work. 
I am most humbly indebted to you. You will be highly rewarded for your expertise, of course. But first, we have a long day ahead of us, turning all the other robots back into humans. Tally ho! Rocococo Audio Game. Fantastic! Play. Quit. Options. Take credits. Rocococo Audio Game Fantastic. Created, produced, and designed by Casson Crooker, aka the Duke of Candid Apples. Music by Rococo Co. Unity programming and additional game design by Joseph Crump. Story and script by Lyra Kupala. Additional Unity programming by Joseph Knesuk. Additional Unity programming by Ben Lane. Butler voice acting by Pete Beaumont. Queen voice acting by Elsa Peruzan. Published by Speed of Dark Studios. Credits. Change sensitivity. Play. Quit. <laughs>